We are at the comic book store in Little Rock, Arkansas, and this is owner Michael. How's it going? How are you doing? Good, how are you? Doing okay. You mind giving us a tour of your store? Sure, come on inside. Thank you. Thanks. Well, this is my second location. I opened up this location in uh, June of 1989, the month that the uh, Batman movie hit, which was a perfect time to open up a comic book store because all I do is had to hang a Batman t-shirt in the window and traffic would just stop. <laughs> been doing it ever since and this is actually my second location I moved into this location in June of uh, 1990 and I'm still here so this store just celebrated its uh, 22nd anniversary uh, back in June and uh, this is uh, my second location or altogether not the second place for this store but this is actually my second store I opened up my first store collector's edition in North Little Rock back in September of 1982 and that store celebrates its uh, 29th anniversary next month so you put the 22 and the 29 together that's over 50 years of comics retailing seems like it's been a lot longer <laughs> come on in have a look around uh, thanks uh, we uh, try to carry a little bit of everything we're uh, uh, a family-friendly store, uh, which means we don't sell any adults-only material. Uh, we, here's like our uh, section for youthful readers. That way, when people come in with kids, we can just direct them right here to say, "Hey, everything here is fine. You don't have to worry about it." And uh, of course, the first thing the kids want to do is go to the section they don't think they're supposed to be in. But uh, that's just the nature of kids. Uh, we also have a graphic novel section. Uh, we carry a lot of the, the trading card games and uh, some lady material. And, you're also trying to find little unique things uh, like uh, crystals from China, gold-plated coins. You just try to give a variety of things for people. Uh, we've got uh, a lot of old books, uh, both uh, with original wrappers and uh, wrappers that I've recreated uh, to restore them back to their uh, original look there. Uh, I figure with the uh, John Carter Mars movie coming out uh, next year, there's going to be a renewed interest in uh, all things at Grass Girls, uh, who's also the creator of uh, Tarzan. And, uh, you know, we have art supplies because we have a lot of uh, people who are interested in art around here. Of course, the figures, the t-shirts, and this is our cheap reading section where we're always promoting uh, reading first. Everything here is just 50 cents a piece, and it's a uh, good variety of stuff. And uh, the parents a lot of times will come over here and just tell them to look for the Comics Code Authority, which uh, these are the hottest demand books. The books in the 90s to the early part of the new millennium that did not have a Comics Code on it, they're going to be almost worthless because uh, people don't know what they are, and you can't even sell them cheap now. Uh, as you can tell, we have kind of a uh, different design on the layout of the store. We have everything where one person went to the store and see what's going on in every aisle. And uh, all these shelves I custom built myself, other uh, my own design. And uh, both stores have matching shelving. And uh, we give uh, full facing, and you can just walk down the aisle and see the full facing on either side very well. And books aren't so piled on top of each other, you can't see anything. arrangement uh, we have our books running uh, is uh, we start we have Marvel's on the top row DC's on the second all the other publishers on the bottom two uh, running alphabetically around uh, the store with Marvel's on the top and so on uh, we also carry an extensive selection of back issue comics including older ones and uh, the high dollar stuff we just don't have enough counter space to put it all out uh, we've got a, a great selection of a lot of older books And then it's uh, books that are below ten dollars. You can see right here. We've got the rows starting here, and right around over here, and then continuing on again past the window all the way to the door. That's our old comic selection there. So we carry a lot of new and old comics. We try to give you a good variety of everything that you might want to read there. All right, great. Thank you so much for showing us uh, around your store, Michael. Oh, sure. Thanks for stopping by. This has been the comic book store in Little Rock, Arkansas, filmed in August 2011.